try to help some people out, explain some stuff. Don't want that. Like I said, this is just simple. Uh, I'm not really trying to make anything cool here. Just trying to get it to work for our purposes. Alright, so for the top, there's a couple ways uh, you can do this. Uh... A lot. Some people use double blades. Uh, you could use a tail rotor. Uh, you could do that either way. Honestly, if you throw enough reaction wheel on it, you won't have to really worry about it spinning out of control. Uh, so, first thing I usually do is I'll just throw one of these on top. Throw this up there just for looks. Yep, first we'll put a put a reaction wheel up here. Scoot this whole thing down. A little clipping never hurt anybody. Alright, so for the rotor just go with this one start with and for the blades we'll just use the medium helicopter blades I'm gonna set this to quad before those on there all right so People usually get here no problem. You got the rotor, you got your blades. Uh, one of the main things people run into a lot is, you know, you get it on a runway, you get the rotor spinning up, but your helicopter just sits there. Uh, a mistake people commonly make is setting their rotor speed to their main throttle uh, thinking that will translate to lift, but it does not. So what you're going to want to do is use the Cal 1000. Take your rotor blades, set them to extended, come over to your action groups, down to the Cal 1000, set your blade authority limiter onto that. Alright. Open your editor. Now, when you set this, I just jump down to the end here, and you're going to want to set this uh, anywhere really. Minus 40 is pretty good. Uh, your goal is, if you're spinning clockwise, you always want the uh, silver side here uh, slanted up when you're at the end of uh, your little program here. So we'll put this back at the beginning. Then we'll go back to our action groups. Set the main throttle to this Cal 1000 play position. So what that'll do is as we throttle up and down it will change the angle of the blades and that's what will generate lift. So the next thing we want to do is make sure your whole rotor assembly here is directly whoop, there we go is directly over the center of mass. So I do a little clipping here, pick that up. So as close as we can get it to the middle there. And then just for some extra stability,
playing on a different save here. I'm not quite sure where everything's located. So put that on both sides. Put a react reaction wheel front and back. Put a battery front and back. And uh, if everything worked right, that should be all you need, basically. Uh, I throw another one of these on. And I will set this to the main rotor torque limit. You don't have to do this, but this just makes it easier to turn it on when you start off so you don't have to manually click on things. So we'll toggle play. Open the editor. Raise this up to 100. So now when we click Custom Action Group 1, it will automatically fire the engines. Alright, so everything's centered, looking good there. Alright, let's see how it flies. Alright, so, like I said, with Custom Action Group 1, it should start our blade up. Turn the SAS on, prevent that spinning as much as we can. And off we go. Now she's a little unstable. I didn't add uh, didn't add wings or anything like that. One thing I forgot to mention is if you if you uh, set this to your main throttle, it automatically starts at two and a half. So even if you are throttled down to zero, its play position is at two and a half. So you want to set this so two and a half. is at zero. Without crashing in the process. Close enough. Alright, so now if I throttle up a little bit, it should start to climb. Rotation. Now if I throttle down, it should start to come down. Lean her back here. there you go. Like I said, if you have questions, uh, you can ask wherever I post this, Facebook, Reddit. Uh, like I said, I'm not a YouTuber. I don't even like my voice. I'm just trying to help some people out. So that's a basic design. You can make it as complicated as you want. Uh, but this is about as simple as it gets. See ya.